What is up guys welcome back to another video today we're going to be removing my exhaust and doing my test pipes today. This is my current situation right now. Uh, you can't even see. Yep, yeah, nope. Nope, you're not even going to be able to see that. I know it looks like a mess right now but... But nothing, damn. I'm trying to see where I can get some good lighting because it's already dark out. Well it's about to be dark out since freaking time has changed and now it's getting dark a lot like three hours earlier so I got some new test pipes and you guys can be able to be there for to be able to stay tuned for that I don't know how the hell I'm gonna do this but from reading reviews and YouTube and all that I've been seeing um, I think I got the idea of it so let's go ahead and see how this turns out but as far as right now I'm just gonna be removing the exhaust tonight and once I get my test pipes it's gonna be off to Shane guys I'm gonna hopefully get it to him after that and be able to do big things with this car because that's my plan. It's currently what it's sitting at right now. It's crazy. But yeah, guys, uh, hopefully I can show you more a little bit this tomorrow because right now, like I said, it's dark and you can't see anything. So hold up, guys. I actually got a message right now saying uh, my girlfriend was telling me to come over to her house because there's a new car there. So I'm going to go check out this new car. and You guys will be able to see that. I'm pretty excited for it. Oh. All right, guys. So I made it. You guys can even see what this is. Oh shit. Let's drive it. <laughs> I drove it guys, but it's not that great. Let's get back to my house. Fuck this shit. There you go, sir. Wedgewood? Oh yes. shit. Oh fuck. Yep. Alright guys, so it's the next morning. I'm gonna hire this guy to fucking do work on my car. I, I don't I don't know how to work. Yeah, you 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 put it in here. Yeah. So this is pretty much what I've done so far. I just took out that white pipe, so I just the X pipe. And I just need the mid pipe and this must be ready to go. It'll be a hanger. Um I'll the mid pipe, hanger over here, and hanger over here. No, you can leave all that there, you don't have to remove those bolts actually, I forgot. I was gonna tell you, we don't need to remove those bolts. Oh yeah! We can just remove the just... hanger, and then yeah. these two hangers over here. Yep. And then that's it. Okay. So these are gone? Yeah, these are gonna be gone now for sure. Oh, yeah. Damn it. Gotcha. We're gonna eat, uh... It's actually almost out. It's not even almost out, never mind. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Like that? Yeah. I got the same. Hey! Put this right there. Fucking hangers, man. Whoever created the hanger, your mom's a hoe. Ow! I know, we should have got the KY jelly, bro. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I'm fine, yeah, I'm fine. Shit. Oh. Oh, dude. Oh. Yep. I didn't restrain that thing. I feel like that'd be better. Noob. What? Watch. All natural. It's gonna come out really fast, right? Watch. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Well, fine. There you go. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Alright, now try to wiggle it out. Yeah. I try to push the pipe so that. There you go. Oh, shit. There you go. Wait, Sally. This shit's gonna hit my nuts, bro. Oh, yeah! <laughs> All right, I need that side WD-40. I mean, uh, now you need that side lubed up. I don't know if you guys can see that. I forgot these freaking pipes were separated. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> oh my God. There you go. Ow, fuck. I think it would have sounded a lot better if this wasn't there, but it, what the hell is this? I guess I used to be ground for something. <laughs> Alright, fuck it, I'm gonna take over. Okay. Uh, it's been like, what, two hours already? I don't plan. Yeah. It's been like two seconds, but we just pulled that. I would just, literally just pulled the exhaust out and then we just pulled it out like that and then like that and then. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the next step is to start the car and see how it sounds like again. All 
right, so next thing we're gonna do is you're gonna take these off uh, the rope. What is it called? Roll bar? Yeah, it's like, yeah, the roll bar, whatever it's called. The sway bar, the front sway, the, the top sway bar links, some, some masterful link sway bars. We're gonna remove this air box and intake, I guess, and see uh, if we can get a hold of that bolt down there. Uh, see, not even. This is gonna be very hard to record because this. Oh, goddamn, the goddamn camera's dirty because it's not picking up. All right, we're gonna get to that bolt down there. You can see uh, it's gonna be a very difficult process to do, but it's gonna be done. Get her done. Remove these is gonna be uh, 14 millimeters. Hell yeah, we got it out. <laughs> uh, remove those, and then you go ahead and use a fly head to remove the, the intakes. All oh, shit right here. Oh, uh, just, just yeah, just get this shit right here. You know, get it with the. Uh, get, with with the, the uh, <laughs> get that shit like that. You so and just uh, put it towards the back, and just pretty much slide it up. Pass the tool, man. Slide it up. Okay. All right, check up. We finally got those freaking uh, air thingies out. Uh, we didn't end up taking the whole thing. It was just actually these two things. You just have to use a, a fly head to remove those. But you don't need to remove that shit because that's just a little pain in the ass to remove. But uh, we just want to have to take off the cover too because it was in a way of our, our doing shits. And so, uh, yeah, it looks like uh, whenever we remove that uh, rubber piece from the coat, uh, from the intake part, this thing was coming off. So we just remove this thing. So we're just going to go ahead and get some power washer and just wash the whole engine bay right now and see what happens including the mass throttle body sensors and all that just all right the homie bailey just came over and he thinks that i'm putting a turbo on the car i'm convincing him that i am so here it is guys he's gonna be the turbo right here but <laughs> we'll find out his reaction right now how he's gonna react to this turbo right here i swear if this is not turbo i'm gonna be so fucking mad it's gonna be like Ooh. all right there we go the turbos oh shit Z1 Motorsports? Okay, I see you. Z1 Turbos? Ooh, look at them turbos, bro. <laughs> <laughs> now, but it's finally I showed you guys what I got. Uh, I got the Z1 Motorsports SS test pipes. That's supposedly what it says. Uh, I don't know what the SS stands for. Don't quote me. I've been hearing a lot of good things about these. It was either this one or the Burke test pipes, but I went ahead and did this, this one because this one actually comes with the bung in case I want to do the air, uh, air fuel ratio sensors and all that. And it comes with the full cool check engine light fix, so I won't have to worry about any lights and shit coming on. So, I mean, the, we got the catalytic converters all looped up. Uh, we're just now we're just gonna wait for it to sit down for a minute and try to take off a little rust. First thing you're gonna do is you're gonna remove this bracket that comes with the catalytic converter. Every time I freaking jack up my car, this is what happens. Oh fuck! <laughs> oh my gosh! Y'all see that, right? All right, so now we're starting to get this removed. And look, y'all check this out. What the hell? So as soon as I broke that loose, this whole thing came out from the actual catalytic converter. This whole thing that was supposed to be welded on. These are all gonna be 14s. Or if you don't have a 14, actually what can work is a 9 16 Actually, if I can show you, here, 9 16 um, You can use that, and it's gonna be the way all the way around. So uh, yeah. All right, so I still smell it. it's on little update. We are still trying to get one bolt out. As soon as you remove this bracket, you're gonna find yourself that you're gonna have this bolt right there on the left side, that bolt up there, and the same thing for the other side. You're gonna have that bolt right here, and then you're gonna have the one right there. And then you're gonna lower lower the car, and you can get to the uh -huh. bolt right over there. The All right, we finally getting this bolt out. Holy crap! It took us a long time getting here. Where we at? All right, this is exactly how it's gonna look like. You're gonna have um, one of your little breaker bars, or however y'all wanna use it. Um, I have a 10 inch extension, but you can use up to like uh, maybe like three eighths or something like that. I have two tens, and then one three eighths, and it was able to do the job just as it is. And at the end, it was a 14 millimeter because all those bolts at the 14s. So um, I pretty much all hooked it up together, just like that, and got it from the top of the engine bay all the way down to that bolt, and broke it loose just like that. 
the best thing I suggest you to do is grab a friend and um, have somebody come down there to just put the bolt on there just in case you don't strip it or anything. And uh, yeah, these are these right here. It's awesome though. And here it is, about to leave. And this is just one side though. <laughs> so I have the other side to go. Oh my gosh, here we go. Ten years later. Uh, eventually. A little more after eventually. Oh my god, how long is this freaking bolt, dude? So here we go. Got it right there. Go ahead and pull it out for me. Oh yeah. 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 Oh fudge. That is a demon bolt. This is the demon bolt. <laughs> I know, right? They said that this was the demon bolt, but oh my gosh, this was fucking wow. Nut. day I have some bad news when I was trying to remove all the bolts off of the cats um, there's one that was actually being really stubborn and the crazy part is is I actually stripped it I'll show you guys here in a second but um, I've been working on and off on this car ever since I was trying to take off the whole exhaust and test pipes and stuff but here let me show you guys what I'm talking about I spray some PB blasters on it already, and there it is. That is what I'm dealing with right now. What the hell? All right, update, guys. So I took it to one of my uncle-in-law, and uh, he was able to take off that bolt for me. So that was pretty cool. So now we're gonna have to get started, and I'm actually gonna get right into it because I know you're probably already tired of me waiting and trying to take this freaking thing apart and put it back on. So. Let's go ahead and get that uh, exhaust put on and see how it sounds already. Here we go. All right, so here it is. This is pretty much how it's going to be looking like right now. These test pipes look awesome. I'm going to plug my whole exhaust back on and uh, plug these O2 sensors back on and see uh, how it sounds like. So here we go. All right, so this is going to be the first startup with the test pipes put on. It's gonna, I hope it sounds amazing. Let's get to this and see how it sounds like. Ready? Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, whatever y'all want to say. I think I'm going to end the video from here. See you guys in the next one. Bueno.